This is Your Health Matters. Hello, I'm Dr. Sandra Freyhofer. Pregnancy can be the best of times or the worst if you have morning sickness. The majority of women, 70 to 85 percent, suffer nausea and vomiting during pregnancy. I was in that majority. At one point, my symptoms were so severe, I got so dehydrated, I required intravenous fluids. And don't let the name fool you, for some symptoms don't hit just in the morning. Mine were 24-7, but I was having twins, which often means more morning sickness. Well, expect it, ladies, you're in luck. The FDA recently approved a new medication for treating morning sickness. It's actually an old medicine with a new name. Diclegis has been available in Canada for the last 30 years. Now it's coming back to the United States. It was sold here under the name Bendectin, but the previous manufacturer stopped making it in 1983 due to high litigation costs. There were claims that caused birth defects. Those claims were found to be untrue. The active ingredient is doxylamine, a common over-the-counter antihistamine, combined with the B6 vitamin, pyridoxine. The FDA says this medicine is safe, it won't harm you or your baby. But before you head to the drugstore, FDA says you must try natural ways to reduce symptoms first. Eat several small meals rather than three large ones. Eat bland, low-fat foods and avoid smelly foods. Your nose is more sensitive to certain smells when you're pregnant. Dad, you can help too. Have crackers around to keep mom's stomach settled. If your morning sickness symptoms don't respond to diet and lifestyle changes, Diclegis is a welcome remedy, but there can be a downside. Drowsiness. Do not drive or operate machinery while taking it. Talk to your doctor about how to make it a better morning. With Your Health Matters, I'm Dr. Sandra Freyhofer. Your Health Matters is a production of Georgia Public Broadcasting.